Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> My uh, cold has been a little bit worse. <clears throat> but I just got to do this. So the war has, we have a, we have gotten another war. Core 2. With a Z. Against the North American Wolf Pack. 20. They got a nice little uh, symbol there. Check them out. It's like a biohazard radioactive thing going on there. Alright. Blind as a bat, so it's kind of nice to be able to see them now. Yeah. Try to compare the numbers here. <clears throat> I mean, we got two guys under 20. But, I mean, we got a level 86 guy and they don't. And we got a level 67 guy and they don't. That's 20 points from us. Uh... So yeah, here we go. Oh, they have more. They have a higher squad level too. Well, their level is. That makes me want to change mine. What does mine say? Yeah, put a little thing in there. I hate that you can't fucking back up stuff, but... I mean, you can't, you can't make a space, you can't like uh, arrow back, you know, and change something you wrote. Can you believe that I'm like uh, sitting here doing stuff like this when you guys are? Uh, we'll see what I can do about cutting that out. Oh my god. What was it? Control F2 to bookmark. So yeah, now, now the question is do I want to do anything about my base? 
The night guy took me. Well, I think whoever you, you know, bigger guys are gonna take me down. Let's see, if I'm the commander, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get taken down. Not that I, you know, I, I don't understand why that would, would be in law, but yeah, sure. Well, let's look at it. I guess I'm just gonna try and make sure that you know the stronger walls are a solid ring. So I'll just trade some of these light blue with the dark blue, <laughs> and, um, and then we'll have. But you know what? I'm not going to put the rest of this on the video. I'm going to put it on. <sighs> Excuse me. We will save the changes though. Let's go back to our base. Oh, would you look at that? The ship is done. That means that I have finally a useful weapon. And it's not even a weapon, it's it but it is. Because I mean giving your troops extra health on the battlefield. Well, I mean that's just plain unfair sometimes. <laughs> Let's see if I can find my ship here. So the command ship Command ship is a really cool instrument. As uh, you've seen, it comes along with you in battle. It has different weapons and different things that it can do. Uh, like for instance, uh, these are the two things that I, well, you see the ones that are active, okay? So airstrike, you know, it's pretty cool. Sometimes, you need it sometimes. You're gonna see later on that it's useful it's useful against ground troops it's useful against air this one is better and then you got area healing you see me use that so much in my other uh, attacks i mean that has just been the best thing but i'm starting to find newer weapons now that i'm getting into the heavier stages the heavier the later stages here we got the air spot. This is like a single strike. Yeah, that one's a cool one too. Try to keep it upgraded. Got to see here. And this is the last one I got on my other command ship. I've just been uh, experimenting with that in the last couple of attacks that I've been doing. Check it out. It shuts the weapon down for like five seconds. And uh, I guess upgrading it uh, makes the duration even longer. So those pesky missile turrets that like to take out my ravens can be shut down while they get shot at. This one is also combat stimulant. Yeah, this speeds your troops up and their damage. That'll be the next thing I get. But I mean, those things, like these ones here, you get from... you. You have to spend ore to buy them. These ones here, they, they cost uh, uranium to upgrade. These ones cost ore to upgrade. This one we looked at. 
and they all they, they all have different effects okay so it, most of them are a splash and the energy cost varies dirty bomb I've used that a few times it's pretty useful in the early stages when you get it and it'll be useful now actually that can be used against um, that can be used against the ravens if you have it um, draw them out you know with one troop and then just uh, bomb them with the dirty bomb and let that do the job for you the problem is is that it's pretty weak in the early like like the level one level two you want to get the level up this one's cool for uh, taking out walls I think yeah so I mean once I get the destabilizer I won't need to have these um, these uh, six uh, wall breakers what, what are they called anyway wall busters uh, c4 roach the roaches yeah they are cool though <laughs> now that you know now that I got got the idea how to use them build now what are we gonna build now I got enough uranium to do some things get my factory up uh, it's gonna take a couple of days isn't it anyway, what can I produce for upgrade couple days yeah so uh, to the next war I'll have that shipped cool yeah, let's do it oh look at that I just spent all my uranium so I guess uh, when the command ship gets upgraded here or gets uh, gets updated here we'll go for an attack and see how that works out this just made my army a lot more powerful It'll be harder to kill. And by the time, oh, right on. So this will come into play before the war ends. So that's cool. Oh, yeah. I've just been out walking around a lot, so all of a sudden when I sat down here and started doing this, I just got like a, got a bunch of yawn attacks, probably making everybody tired. Yeah, the yawns are contagious. So there, so there, all right. Actually, you know, I don't think that you can do too on with that. Look at that again. So it costs 14 energy. And the ship has 26. And the first level, I mean, the first time you use it, it costs 14. The second time you use it, I think it costs 16 or 18. So the price goes up. So you get one out of that. So, I mean, if I don't need that, I can make an attack now and test it out. I'm just going to do that. Uh, oh. Get a little bonus for victories. So, let's take on somebody a little bit bigger. Then. We want to collect some uranium now for all the uranium we just spent. Ninety thousand, level thirty-three. Are we that cocky? Just because we got the health thing. Uh, 
I don't think so. Level 30 though. 29,000. No, thank you. No, thank you. 112. This looks better. Look at that. He's even upgrading one of his weapons. Only one, but that's good. So let's attack him. And notice how that one is bigger than that one. So we'll take out this guy first. We'll go out after him so that I can get my ratings out. I think we're on to something here. I mean... Come on, take out that gun. You got that laser tower, good boy. Didn't even need to use my uh, offensive units. Oh, they weren't even ravens, Jesus. Okay. Now that just puts a smile on my face. I gotta share it. <laughs> oh, let's do it. Where is it? Attack log, of course. Get out of here. <clears throat> right on. Let me see. No, they don't tell you how. Uh, they don't tell you how. Uh, what his level was. So whatever. We are underway. There, so um, I guess I've done a little bit of a, a base attack and upgrade and a test of my new what is that called anyway? Splash health, a new area healing, introduction to the command ship now that it's starting to be useful. So yeah, and those things you can upgrade in the uh, in the center, of course, where everything else gets upgraded. I think I might have uh, recorded one of those. Research center. Right, one day, two hours. Hmm. I'm gonna go collect my 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 bonus. Cool. I'm getting uh, six uh, red mins now for every day for attacking. For getting ten stars and attacks, which is nice. So there. So there.
Happy Halloween, everybody. This is Wolfie signing off from Galaxy Control. Peace out.